<laughs> hey everyone, it's Nesty and welcome to my first vlog ever. Actually, this is not my first time speaking in front of a camera. Story time! I usually take videos on random days that I want to keep a memory of visually because I like re-watching what I recorded and reminisce that moment. I do this with my family, friends, and my boyfriend every time I miss them or I just want a good laugh. Anyways, speaking of my boyfriend, in relation to this video and the videos that I will be uploading this coming weeks, I will talk about Filipino relationships or more specifically, the Jowa culture. So, for this video, I will focus on how the Filipino way of dating evolved through time. First, we all know that paniligaw or courting is known to us Filipinos. Before, men are usually the ones showing effort and initiating the first move. But now, especially with the millennials who are, as people say, woke, they claim that women can also do the courting. Moreover, men aren't obligated to always do the first move to get into a relationship. This is actually a positive thing because it shows equality and even feminism. Second, relationships before usually start as friends and then the courting stage and then the relationship itself. There's not much in between. Now, a lot of stages and even labels happen. Like first, being friends and then the one will have a crush on the other and then the other will like them back so they will be called MU and then they will be exclusively dating because they don't want to be official yet. And then after a long time of dating, or actually making landian, they will be official. Some don't even have labels, but when they are asked, Ano ba talaga meron sa inyo? They will say, Ewan, basta may something kami. <laughs> Modern dating is just so complicated. But at least, people are happy. Moving on, this change is probably the most important for Filipinos and even the whole world. Before, gay and lesbian relationships aren't that tolerated by many. But now, most people are already open about the LGBTQ community. This reflects an enormous cultural change as many already accept them and don't criticize them. Overall, even if there had been a lot of changes in the Filipino way of dating, it is important to appreciate them and to mind one's own business. We shouldn't judge others' way of getting into relationships because we are all unique. Just be ourselves and let everyone be happy in their own special ways. Yeah! That's all for this video. Thank you for watching and see you all in my next vlogs. Bye!